when looking at crude oil WTI, we can clearly establish that we are trading basically within a grand super cycle ABC, which is basically marked on the chart as A, B, and of course we would be expecting the C wave to pan out in time of course now let's go let's go basically let's let's analyze this this piece right here obviously we have a rise here which was the start of the grand super cycle within super cycle a purple and then the contraction which of course took it longer time so typically for a wave b here um, super cycle wave b basically contracted within a complex structure w x y followed by of course the strongest move of all the c wave the super cycle c which is marked with purple with five swings sequence one two three four and then the fifth wave being the strongest among all now obviously after that we can clearly see that we've 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 contracted quite a lot within this a wave followed by this rise within basically which gave a pattern of a contracting triangle within this super cycle B thus followed by obviously this um, great fall in the super cycle C and completing grand super cycle B now what we will do on the charts of course we will be analyzing this piece right here the current rise which is uh, basically basically showing a very very complex uh, structure which could develop as a WXY or as an ABC within a leading diagonal for what's to come so how about it let's start analyzing the charts let's do our Fibonacci measurements and let's start labeling 